welcome here to the Joy Generation and at our launch of Sharing Corn, Volume 2, our Leadership and Self-Leadership Awareness Journal, which is about constructing and embodying new models of understanding. And today I have with me beautiful Lila, all the way from Brazil, who is one of our special contributors in this version. So Lila, welcome and tell us a little bit more about yourself and what inspired you to contribute to the journal. Okay, so my name is Leila. I'm here from Brazil, and in, especially in Niterói, in Rio de Janeiro. And I am 62 years old. So when I was in the university, I studied engineering. And I was uh, always very much interested in education, and especially doing things in a different way, not like assembly lines, not everything equal to everybody, not equal to everybody, but this, the same stuff, the same, treating kids as students or treating patients as patients. I want to treat people as people with names and, and think about different ways to do stuff. So I worked for 16 years in the biggest uh, professional training for uh, industry here in Brazil. And then when computers came to education, because of my, my previous knowledge and everything, I was very much interested about what we could do different. And then I opened a company that is 25 years old now. And my company is a software company, uh, also, Open a space, uh, open space for children to to do what whatever they are interested in doing and learning. Uh, so we we have worked with more than two thousand five hundred kids until now. Some of them for more than ten years. Many of them work with me today. So it's a very very good place to be. My this company, and in this uh, twenty five years, I met many people. One of them was Hanali. And I love her. So normally everything that she asks me or she, oh, maybe we could do this together. Yes, uh, normally I'm ready to do it. And I love to write. I always loved to, to write. And I wrote for the, the journal about innovation in the company, um, innovation in the learning space at the company as a learning space, how we make this space of um, prosperous, not prosperous, but good, good for people to meet each other uh, and have spontaneous conversations. That's the way we think ideas uh, really evolve, are born and evolve in this kind of meetings. So that's, that's wh what my, my paper is about. I, tell a, a little about our experience. I go uh, far away in the past when things begin to be possible, uh, not so hierarchical, more like yeah, places to where people can be kind of the same and interact with whomever they, they want to. And that's, that's the story I, I tell there. I hope you all enjoy and comment and everything. Oh, Lila, I, 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 I've, I've read it and I can just tell everybody that besides me loving Lila as well and everything that she's been doing, she's been very inspirational, is with this topic of network learning in the workplace. I think there is definitely something in for everybody. So I'd love to invite you to get your copy, which will be available on Amazon and um, which will be in the link of this video as well. So really go ahead and get your copy because you will really enjoy Lila's contribution. Thank you, Lila. And once again, thank you for being always willing to, to play together. I mean, that's what life is about. Bye-bye. Yes. So basically... Beijo, get your copy.